सॉल्व x पावर फोर माइनस टू एक्स क्यू माइनस सेवन एक्स स्क्वायर प्लस एट एक्स प्लस ट्वेल्व इक्वल टू जीरो टू सॉल्व दिस फर्स्ट आई हैव टू शफल द गिवन टर्म्स इन दिस वे सी x पावर फोर बिसाइड एट आई राइट एक्स स्क्वायर टर्म बिसाइड एट I write the constant. After that, I write x cube and then x. Okay, now the reason for shuffling the terms is now I can factorize these three terms. I factorize these three terms here. See. It is x power four minus seven x square plus twelve. How do we factorize quadratic in the same way we factorize this? We, I have to change the middle term that is x square term. Here one into twelve is twelve. Here I should get seven. So four plus three is seven. Four into three is twelve. So in place of minus seven x square, I write minus four x square minus three x square plus twelve. Now, from these two terms, take out x square common. So here I get x square and here I get minus four. Here I got x square minus four means here also it should be x square minus four. From this, x square is gone inside, so outside is minus three. Now take out x square minus four common. Here I get x square and here I get three. Minus three. Okay. Now, in place of these three terms, I replace this over here. Clear? Let us replace. In place of these three, now I write x square minus four and x square minus three. Now, from these two terms, what can be taken out common is minus two x. So here I get x square and here I get four. See man, minus minus plus two x into four is eight x. Now from this entire equation, what can be taken out common is x square minus four. So here I get x square minus three, and here I get minus two x equal to zero. Next. X square minus four. Here, let us rearrange this equation. X term first and then constant. Now, this is a quadratic. So I will factorize this quadratic equation here. That is x square minus two x minus three. To factorize this, I have to change the middle term that is x term. So one into minus three is minus three. Three into one is three. Three minus one is two. So in place of minus two x, now I write minus three x plus one x minus three. Clear? In place of minus three x, I have written. In place of minus two x, I have written minus three x plus one x. Now, from these two, take out x common. So here I get x, and here I get three. Here you got x minus three, so here also you should get x minus three. From this, x is gone inside, so outside should be plus one. Now take out x minus three common. So here it is x, and here it is plus one. Now, in place of this quadratic, I replace this over here. Clear? Let us replace. 
so x square minus 4 in place of this quadratic I write this that is x minus 3 and x plus 1 equal to 0 more they told you to solve that means you need to find the values for x here product of these brackets equal to 0 so to get the values for x you equate each bracket to 0 that is this equal to 0 this equal to 0 or this equal to 0 so it is x square minus 4 equal to 0 or x minus 3 equal to 0 x plus 1 equal to 0 so now to get x here first add 4 on both sides so this cancel out i get x square equal to 4 so now to get x shift square to the other side it becomes square root of 4 that is plus or minus 2 okay next to get x you add 3 on both sides so i get x equal to 3 so here to get x you subtract 1 on both sides so we get x equal to minus 1 so these are the values for x and this is our answer am i clear